Now a series of photos shared by Somali businessman Jamal Rosafi featuring him alongside female politician Sabina Wanjiru Washege has ignited a storm of discussions on social media platforms. The pictures taken during a Friday visit to Jamal's town offices depict a seemingly celebratory mood between the two figures, raising questions about the nature of their relationship. In one particular image, Shege can be seen leaning onto Jamal's office desk, reaching into touching his face, a gesture that has attracted attention for its suggestive nature. Jamal captioned the photo with a simple, it was nice catching up Mwesh, tagging her Instagram account. The post quickly garnered widespread comments, with some expressing approval and dominance creating a buzz around the controversial meeting. However, not all reactions have been positive. The photos also drew criticism from vigilant social media users, particularly from the Muslim community, who pointed out that the duo was sitting on a Quran. Lawyer Ahmed Nasir Abdullahi highlighted his issue, stating, literally sitting on the Quran, maybe he wanted it as a witness. End of quote. Jamal, seemingly unfazed by the controversy, went on to repost comments, suggesting a degree of amusement at the wave of reactions. Lord Abraham Mutoi did not mince words, labeling the situation as irresponsible. The photos, coupled with the choice of the Quran as a seat have brought the duo under public scrutiny. This is MQ News.